Florida residents bracing for Hurricane Helene. Our KATC weather experts and storm trashers with a look at the powerful storm heading for the Sunshine State. More lawmakers condemning comments made by Louisiana Republican Congressman Clay Higgins towards Haitian migrants. We have his response tonight. It was clear in my heart, just take the post down. And in St. Landry Parish, tenants are speaking out against the St. Landry Parish Housing Authority. Our Paris Flanagan has the details on what is causing the uproar. I spent eight hours cleaning that stove and I still could not use the stove. All of that and more tonight on Acadiana's News Channel at 10. I'm Angie Dussain. Thank you for joining us for Acadiana's News Channel at 10. Our reporters are in your parish bringing you news from your neighborhood. But first, we begin tonight with a look at Hurricane Helene making landfall in Florida. Tonight, our weather expert Rob Perillo with a look at what residents can expect. Rob. Thanks, Angie. Weather-wise, well, we are watching uh, this storm finally making landfall. Helene just about on shore. Still a Category 4 storm, 140 mile per hour winds. It's not going to intensify any further, but it's hauling to the north northeast at 24. Pressure, though, continues to drop this evening, so this is another storm that has momentum, intensity, and that's going to carry well inland and into Georgia as well, where hurricane winds will be likely and widespread damage as well. Big storm surge underway right now and very heavy rainfall as well. And of course the high winds and it's going to be problematic through much of the southeast U.S. Meanwhile for us, we're in very good shape locally. We started out in the upper 60s today. We're going to be even cooler than that for tonight. Topped out at 87 degrees and tonight uh, we're in the low to mid 70s. But notice Opelousas, Alexandria already down into the mid to upper 60s. So a little taste of fall in the air overnight tonight and for tomorrow morning. It's going to be invigorating and then another beautiful day for tomorrow and we have a nice stretch of weather ahead. But we'll have more on Helene and there's other systems out in the Atlantic we need to pay attention to. We'll have the very latest details and hurricane update coming your way with a live report or a report from our storm tracker out in the storm in Florida coming up in just a little bit.